style and all right, you know, I got Buckeyes, you know. Like, I try to ask. Um, one of uh, one of Ohio's own was uh, victim of a hate crime today, LeBron James. Um, you heard the story, you know. Um, it's unfortunate. Do you agree? You know, do you feel the same way? You know, like that that racism he was saying is always kind of going to be a part of this world. Will it, will it, will it ever go away? Will this kind of a hatred? You know. Um. I mean, I agree 100% with LeBron James. I think that uh, racism definitely still exists. We are, we fall victims to it every single day. I mean, you see all the hate crimes against the police against black people and this Black Lives Matter uh, movement that's been going on. And the WNBA, NBA also supports this extremely uh, heavy. And I think that for a public figure like him who has done so much for the community and has given back so much, it just really shows that it's going to always be amongst us and it's something that we just have to deal with. So I think we just need to rally together and stay together and you know, be a voice in that. The WNBA and the NBA needs to continue to try to eliminate this issue and I think that he's one of the people who can start it um, and we can just back him up. And you see a lot of athletes stepping up and making statements and, and, uh, and, and that's big, you know? Do you feel like this season, you know, and even the playoffs will be, become a stage, or should be a stage for more statements like this, you know, maybe more more protests in, in games, you know, like Kaepernick type stuff and things like that? Most definitely. I'm, I mean, I think so many people watch the finals that it, it should be a stage. It should be something where they voice their opinions and they come together, whether they're playing against each other or not. I think that the Warriors and the Cavs need to, you know, before the games come out and say, you know, the world, we're all here on, on the same stage doing the same thing, trying to be successful in life, and I think that that alone would be such a huge thing for our, Welcome to Los Angeles. our movement this is to make the world uh, more equal and making it everybody think that everybody is the same. I think that um, right here in it really saddens me that he Current had to deal with that because he's such a good person and he uh, really USA. believes in giving back and he wants to do so much for people from Terminal uh, 2. that the Bob Hope USO the is a should be a huge hour uh, today. And is available to current members of the I, military I mean, I guess I would say place for them to come out and really put a fair about it. Have you ever um, like, experienced like, things like this? Thank you for your service. Yeah, support. I mean, I get stared at a lot, um, especially like I play in Europe all the time. Um, they're not really used to us being over there. But um, first of all, we're black and then we're, we're tall, we're athletes. So um, it's definitely foreign over there. I mean, in America, you could deal with that at restaurants. I mean, I think it's just so prevalent that we don't, we kind of ignore it a little bit. Um, but it, it's definitely amongst us, and I think that it's something that we need to come out and speak more about. Hey, do you have any message for the the, the vandal that, that wrote that, you know? I mean, clearly, you just, they just don't have enough to do. I think that, you know, for you to just have the time for your hands to go and write that on his wall, I mean, on his house, it's just, I mean, for what? Like, I think it's stupid, I think it's silly, and I think that, um, People need to really realize, like, okay, if you have hatred in your life, just keep that amongst your family and you, and let everybody else live happy. <laughs> <laughs> Any words for LeBron? Keep standing strong. Be my favorite player. Uh, um, just, just be a voice for us and let people know how you feel and don't, you know, don't be quiet about it because it's definitely amongst us and people need to be, people want to hear you. Thank you so much. Thank you. I appreciate it.